Hey everyone, what's up? It's Ventus with Fire Emblem Heroes, and this is going to be a summon video. Not for Tempest Trials. I do want to summon from this one. This one is pretty cool, but... Oh, not this one. Definitely not that one. But we're going to continue with Elysian Summer. It's like every two days is a summon. 3.75% right now. The idea for this summon is to not get a T5. Because when it reaches 4%, I mean, it's it's just a number. It doesn't really matter, but 4% seems like a nice, even number where I can just start cherry-picking. So the idea today is to just get fodder, if possible. But if not, it's okay. Doesn't matter. Just gonna do 20 orbs, and then we'll get more orbs with Tempest Trials, with uh, Voting Gauntlet. Voting Gauntlet's already over, but we'll be getting the orbs, I'm assuming, very soon. I think it's like 10 orbs, maybe 15. Daily logins, etc. Yeah, let's do it. 20 orbs. Oh, wow, lots of blues. Okay, there's a good chance of getting Robin then. This is actually every color that I want. But I can't get Frederick and Gaius because there's only one colorless. So let's get rid of the colorless first and then see what happens. Maybe this is like all T5s. That'd be amazing. Never mind. It's Reese, isn't it? It's always Reese. Okay, it's Niles. It's like Reese, Saizo, Niles. Those are my cursed ones. Super cursed. He's not even really Iceberg fodder. I don't feel like upgrading him for Iceberg. It's stupid. I've done it before, though, but it's, it's stupid. Alright, let's get rid of Hector, Faye, Tiki, Titania. A better Bowie for Tempest Trials? Mine is alright, I guess. Better one. Garbage. Cherche. Again. I mean, not again, but another one. Ah, damn it. Okay, well, the last three are blues. So it's gonna be like, what, Donald Tsubaki Est? I'm pretty hopeful. It sounds good. Let's get rid of the bottom one. Seriously, at least give me fodder. There's no Hinata though, unfortunately. Wow! It is Donal. Of course it is. When is it not Donal? Holy crap. Tsubaki? Est? Florina? Oh my god. Odin. Okay, okay. I kind of want Robin, because I want Bonfire Fodder. Wow, this is so disgusting. What a disgusting summon. There's one fodder, I guess. One decent fodder. That's really disgusting. So, if... It goes according to plan. This is not going to be Robin. And then I'll do cherry picking later on. But this could be Robin. This could be Reinhardt. Could be Noe. Could be Effie. Could be Tsubaki. Could be another Donald. Guess I'll find out. Well, at least there's a shockwave. Let's see what it is. Ah. Okay, Roderick. Okay, so if the bonus heroes don't change... No, but they are gonna change. I said this in the arena video, uh, but if the bonus heroes didn't change, then I would have to use one of these units. One of the T4 units that used to be T5. Roderick is pretty good for many reasons, actually. He's got a nice weapon. I mean, it's, it's not really that nice, but you can do some really fun stuff with it. So that's interesting fodder. He also has drive defense, which is really nice. It's like a larger AoE version of Spur defense. And then he also has rally defense resist, which is pretty good. This thing, I think, if you put it on Erika and Ephraim, 
you give every single buff without using sacred seals. So that's pretty insane. If you have a strong blade tome user, then this is actually really insane. He has a lot of nice stuff, to be honest. Let's check his stats. I might just keep him. We'll see. Because he is just a, a T4, right? Where is he on the list? This is a minus HP plus attack. Oh! Oh, wow, really? 8 attack plus 11 is 19. Wow, minus HP plus attack. Interesting. Minus HP is... I mean, if you run Desperation on him, it's good. But his speed isn't that great. Oh, he's actually pretty fast for a Cavalier unit. He's the fastest, if not one of the fastest. 34 speed base, 37 if it's plus. Okay. That's interesting. Although I don't think minus HP is that efficient, because... You're probably not going to be running Desperation on him. I mean, I guess there's potential. If he's plus speed and you run a Brave Lance and you use Cavalry buffs, it puts him up to 47 speed. Or, I guess, 42. I'm probably going to keep him. We'll see. But he does have good stuff to give away as well. So I'm, I'm kind of on the fence about this one. Alright. Well, the summon wasn't completely awful then. The pinnacle was good. The pinnacle is is either always Reese or always good, is it? I don't know. That was alright. But we're at 4% now, so this is cherry picking territory whenever it loads. Yeah, 4%. So I'm going to start saving some orbs. I'm not going to do a summon in like 2-3 days, even though I probably can. And uh, the idea is to just cherry pick blues and greens, I think. I think cherry picking colorless is really optimistic. The ideal situation would have been to get Gaius or Frederick prior to cherry picking, but we'll see when the time comes. So after doing Tempest Trials and all that, I should have probably 40, 50 orbs by the end of the month. And uh, I guess around that time I'll, I'll do a summon. I'll probably do one before that actually. Because there's still so much time. There really is, is still a month left. It's what, the 3rd today? July 3rd? This thing ends on July 30th, I think. No, August 1st. July 31st, I guess. It's 31 days in July, 30 in June. There's still a lot of time. Okay. Well, I was an okay summon. I'm okay with this. I don't have really high expectations or whatever. Hopefully next time though, the cherries will be nice. Cherries are delicious. Alright, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you guys next time for more Fire Emblem Heroes. Have a nice day.